How is federal income tax calculated? Hello everyone. Today, we're going to dive into the world of federal income tax. We will break down how it's calculated, what goes into the process, and we'll also explain key terms like tax brackets, deductions, and credits. So, let's get started. What is federal income tax? Federal income tax is a pay-as-you-earn system of taxation imposed by the federal government on the annual earnings of individuals, corporations, trusts, and other legal entities. It's an important source of revenue for the government and is used to fund public services and infrastructure. How is taxable income determined? Before you can start calculating your tax, you need to determine your taxable income. This is the amount of your earnings that's actually subject to tax. Here's how you do it. 1. Start with your gross income. This includes all your income for the year, such as wages, self-employment earnings, interest income, dividends, and other sources. 2. Subtract adjustments to income. Some examples of adjustments include student loan interest, contributions to a traditional IRA, or alimony payments for divorces finalized before 2019. 3. Subtract deductions. You can either take the standard deduction, which is a fixed amount based on your filing status, or itemize your deductions if they add up to more than the standard deduction. What you're left with after all these steps is your taxable income. What are tax brackets and how do they work? The U.S. uses a progressive tax system, meaning that different portions of your income are taxed at different rates. These ranges of income are referred to as tax brackets. Each tax bracket has a rate and a range of income to which it applies. The income ranges are different depending on your filing status, single, married filing jointly, married filing separately, or head of household. Let's clarify this with an example. Say you're a single filer, and your taxable income is $50,000. You'd pay a lower rate on the first portion of your income, up to a certain limit, and a higher rate on the next portion, from that limit to $50,000. What about tax credits? After your tax is initially calculated based on the tax brackets, you may be able to reduce your tax liability even more by applying tax credits. A tax credit is an amount that is subtracted directly from the tax you owe. Examples of tax credits include the Child Tax Credit, the American Opportunity Tax Credit for education expenses, and the Earned Income Tax Credit for low to moderate income workers. So that, in a nutshell, is how federal income tax is calculated. The process involves determining your taxable income, applying the tax rates based on the tax brackets, and finally subtracting any tax credits you may qualify for. We hope this explanation helped demystify the process for you. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.